Hello guys, Wizard here bringing you another Total War Warhammer replay with commentary for today's battle. We have the forces of High Elves who are being led by Tyrion, and we finally found him, boys. We finally found Walkmar the Grim, and yeah, this is this is gonna be fun. It's not the most competitive build, but it's pretty show, uh, pretty close. So. Uh, we'll see how Tyrion performs against them. I really wanted to try this out, so I will. I got a chance to do it. So let's just jump into the army composition. For my front line, I have four units of rangers and a unit of spearmen. Uh, that's my whole front line. I have two units of Lothran Seagull Seaguards with shield. I love these guys, and also two. Uh, shadow warriors who are also really good in this matchup because they have stock and they can find targets uh, Really easily because they can get close to them three units of silver helms with shield as you guys know no healing no dragon princess and Speaking of magic. We have a mage of metal here with Plague of Rust, Final Transmutation, and Book of Hoeth. Uh, she's not on a, on a horse, and uh, yeah, because I didn't have any more gold to uh, pick a horse for her. So, uh, for my opponent here, let's see what he has here. We have a lot of spearmen. Let's see, one, uh, five units of spearmen with shield. So, a weak front line, but a lot of range units here, and some cap. Uh, we have Sigmar Sons, an autopic um, unit in my opinion. We have Hellstone Battery, uh, Rocket Battery. We have two handgunners, um, Huntsman Regiment of Renown, the White Wolves. We have two Empire Knights and a unit of Demigriff Knights, a regular con, which, is, which are fine. I usually prefer the Halberd against High Elves, but against Dark Elves, these guys are really good. Interestingly enough, my opponent uh, has decided to bring a foot a caster here we have a bright wizard awesome looking model with a lot of spells all of them in fact we have kindle flame fireball cascading fire cloak flaming sword of ruin burning head uh, flame storm and piercing bolts of burning and for our nemesis Volkmar the grim on top of his uh, chariot we ha uh, is it the chariot probably is wagon or whatever it is we have grand soul fire grand shield of fate grand hammer of sigmar banishment divine power and benediction so uh yeah without further ado let's just start a battle and see how Tyrion is gonna deal with workmar here so um yeah just one more thing i brought everything on Tyrion, I think, stand or die, uh, I mean, stand your ground, faint and repose, Sunfang, Foe Seeker, Heart of Avalon, so um, pretty much everything here. So Tyrion is going in, um, I haven't seen this guy, this guy's yet, I think at this stage I do, and I'm charging right, right in because we have the sword. Sunfang to just decimate this unit really fast and it's gonna pay for itself but some pesky de demigriff knights try to trying to stop Tyrion here so I pop faint and repost and we're gonna duel them while my other units get close and now uh, shadow warriors are shooting the demigriff knights doing decent damage here my silver hand I don't want these empire knights to get into my range unit so I have to stop them as soon as possible Let's just watch here the value the uh, Sunfang can get. 4 kills, 200, 300. Let's just watch this. Yeah, that was on Tyrion. <laughs> let's, let's see. Uh, 45 kills and 600. So around uh, 3 to 400 value just with one cast. That how good that item is. I'm really happy about uh, realizing how items work in this game. On this side... Walkmar is also using his AOE infantry killing abilities here. That unit is gone. Let's see, probably around 500 value. Uh, no, pretty close though, 400. But we're doing fine. The knights have been stopped, at least some of them. Some of them, unfortunately, are uh, moving into my back line, unfortunately. And that Hellstorm rocket battery is still shooting there. But good news is some rangers have gotten into the back lines they were able to 
I don't know. Maybe there weren't any units in front of them, so they were able to move into these hand gunners. My uh, silver helms are fighting some white wolves. Uh, some white wolves, no, not some white wolves. The white wolves. The other silver helms who have uh, run through the left flank now they're in fighting some hand gunners, which is nice. One of them is free, unfortunately, but I have to break these guys before I can. Uh, stop them from shooting so I might lose some models there. Tyrion tried to go uh, for the Bright Wizard here and uh, yeah I was doing some damage but Volkmar decided to not kill infantry and decide, uh, decided to fight Tyrion which is a really bad idea. Um, I have tried this, um, these guys fighting one on one and I think Tyrion wins under two minutes with no helps and any buffs so yeah, he, he can win without taking any damage or any significant damage. And my Lothran Sigurd were shooting Volkmar at the start of the battle and they, they're still doing so, which is nice. But I think my opponent's uh, army is uh, in a really big trouble here. These Demigriff Knights are getting some clean charge into these silver helms. I didn't realize that these guys are back. They were <laughs> hiding in the forest, unfortunately. But I think with killing Walkmar, the whole army is going to break. Even before that, the whole army decides to run away. And I think my opponent is gonna uh, GG at uh, any point now. Even though he has some unbreakable units, they can't do anything. So a cl close victory here. So I think this army is really good. And uh, I have played with uh, something similar uh, to this army against uh, Empire before, uh, but uh, the Empire player picked, um, I think, Carl, and yeah, I uh, Tyrion was able to do fine there as well. So 12k damage dealt, insane. I think most of that is uh, from uh, Sunfang, but uh, beating the breaks of Wokmar is um, also probably. Uh, um, also is counted there. My uh, spellcaster literally, literally did nothing because, um, yeah, I just ran through everything. My opponent didn't have enough time to uh, react and stop me. Uh, I usually pick the caster because of the plague of rust is really good against Walkmar and final transmutation is really good against cap units and especially demigriff knights. But um, yeah, I didn't um, find any opportunities to cast a spell. My infantry did fine. Uh, the range units probably did better. Yeah, they did fine. Also, uh, Shadow Warriors did decent. Uh, I wasn't able to show you guys, but one of the Empire Knights was able to get into uh, these guys and stop them from shooting. But uh, it wasn't uh, too bad because one of my knights was there to uh, stop them and they were damaged uh, beforehand. So. Yes, yeah, Silver Helm's doing really great. Even this one uh, who joined the fight too late did great. Workmall not being able to get much value. The rest of the infantry, uh, yeah, doesn't look like they were able to do much, unfortunately. So, uh, yeah, that's it for this battle, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I would really appreciate it if you guys consider leaving a like and subscribing. I also have a Discord server. If you guys want to join, chat, uh, hang out, or just um, you want to find an opponent, um, yeah, you can find the link in the description. I uh, rather pl play with, um, with uh, my Discord um, members. That would be nice. Uh, we can chat. We can talk about builds. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. And uh, that's it. Catch you all later. Bye.